Today's horoscope from Astro Academy, Capricorn February 11, 2022. A class you've wanted to take might open up, and you'll want to register right away. However, you might have a few difficulties. If you sign up by phone, the line may be continually busy. If you enroll online, your service provider might be down. Don't get discouraged and give up. These are only temporary delays, and you won't want to miss out on the class. Keep trying. Right now, you could be in a bouncy mood. Planetary energies will be boosting your confidence. You'll have a rosy view of the world, looking at things in a positive way. You'll be able to let go of some recent stresses and surrender difficult issues. Spend time with people who love you today. You'll enjoy sharing this positive mood with your loved ones. And people always like a sunny companion. Consider combining your strong ambition with a little hard work. Your ability to focus on your goals and aspirations for the future will be stronger today. All you need to do to achieve what you want is be willing to work hard. Even if what you want is to never have to work hard again, you'll have to expend a lot of effort to reach the point where you can afford it. The nice thing about dreams is they are so good that it's worth working hard to realize them. Just when you think things are settled, life takes another turn. Today is the day for yet another of those turns, so hold on tight. You will likely receive some information that will have a dramatic impact on your life. Perhaps you'll receive an opportunity to move to another state, or another country. Or perhaps your partner will pop the question. One thing is clear, your future is promising indeed. Neptune risks causing confusion and multiplying family misunderstandings, while Uranus will on the contrary make it possible to go ahead and find solutions that are beneficial to all. Mercury in this aspect will be favorable to intellectual or parapsychological works. You might be lightheaded, sometimes with brilliant ideas. Try to be your own seer or medium. Your jaw hits the floor and the latest list of demands comes your way. They might all come from the same person, or it might be an army of friends and co-workers, but you have to deal somehow. Do not give in to the penchant for pitying yourself, you will increase the severity of your difficulties. This could be a powerful day to tap into your intuition. The planets could make you oversensitive to things going on around you, so you may be a little thin-skinned. Don't allow that nervousness to spoil your day. Spend some time by yourself doing something that will help you recharge. If you ground yourself with physical activity or spiritual meditation, you'll be able to use that sensitivity in a good way. How often do you get together with your family? This important group may be in need of a gathering, and you might be the perfect person to make it happen. Even in the home, gathering up the gang to make family decisions can be an excellent way to tackle challenges and specific situations. Whether it's planning for a holiday or devising a chore system, the more heads, the better. See what you can do. You may be surprised at how effective it proves to be. Everything is relative. Were you aware of that? Sometimes it's not so easy to remember that, especially on days like today. If you are not able to follow along in this with everyone else today, you may really feel left out of things. You need to be able to accept the fact that you're probably not as perfect as you think you are. Your truth is not necessarily the absolute truth. Just two days before Venus and Mars are due to align in Capricorn for the first time in two decades, Mercury and Pluto align here for the third time in two months and for the second time just this year. While an alignment between Mercury and Pluto has been at least an annual event since the planet of change and revolution returned to Capricorn in 2008, this is a timely chance to think outside the square and revisit choices, decisions and plans. This comes just as Venus and Mars, the planets with the will and the means to make things happen are coming together. At the same time that Mercury, the planet of communication is preparing to leave Capricorn early next week, the moon is not just preparing to return to your relationship sector tomorrow but will come full circle from last month's full moon. This makes Mercury's alignment with Pluto today a chance to get out in front of this by putting extra effort into ensuring the communication lines are open. 
Your tarot reading for today. The world, the star, and the emperor. The cards highlight the feelings of a person for whom you are very important. This is a man you don't know very well, but who seems to have attached himself to you emotionally. You have met him several times without paying attention, he seemed to you to be busy, remote, and even indifferent. Yet he would like to be closer to you and make you like him, but up until now, circumstances have not given him the opportunity. He is in a different social environment to you and so his interactions with you are quite rare. His feelings for you are now an issue and represent an opportunity for you to renew your emotional life. You have seemed preoccupied recently and felt anxious about the future. Yet you have a lot of potential and the cards evoke great human qualities. You need your family and friends to feel truly happy, but they do not always understand the distress you are in and anyway, you don't want to bother them with your problems. Fortunately, this situation should not last since a new dynamic is moving into your life. This should help you regain the confidence that you had before and the natural optimism that represents you so well. Your draw evokes a lot of questions, but shows something essential, things will evolve positively in your life. This new trend should enable you to make new resolutions and, on the emotional level, to reconnect with the pleasure of sharing a lasting relationship with a man. If you've refrained from telling someone something important or tried to hide your feelings about something, it's all likely to come out when the moon squares Pluto around midday. It might seem like this uncontrollable flood of things you didn't think you were ready to handle is a bad thing, but that isn't necessarily the case. In fact, it could be quite healing for you to get it all out in the open. Even if the epiphany is about your own unhelpful behaviors, examining your outlook, actions, and narrative to make necessary changes is better late than never. In the evening, you get a cosmic kiss from the universe when the sun sextiles the moon. You feel an ease, and you get the sense that it's safe to let down your guard and just be yourself. This means that if you realized some difficult things earlier in the day, you'll be comfortable enough to handle it openly and authentically. This aspect also brings balance to communication with your partner, so use it. Also tonight, the moon moves into the home-loving sign of Taurus, which further increases your urge to cuddle and talk to your partner. Finish the evening sharing some dessert on the couch. Allow yourself this indulgence, you deserve it.